We're in Google Sites, but let's create and get the embed code from our Twitter account for a specific list or search, and then add that to our Twi uh, to our Google Sites page, so that as people come to that page, they can also see relevant uh, Twitter activity that may be happening. So here I'm on my uh, I've got my page ready, uh, but I need to get the embed code from Twitter. So I'm going to go over to my Twitter account, click on my avatar, and come down to Settings and Privacy. Once I'm there, uh, I need to come over and look on the left-hand side where it says Widgets. And you can see I have a lot of widgets created uh, that I've used at one time or another on different pages. Let's say I'm going to look up uh, information for M learning, the hashtag M learning for mobile learning. Uh, let me go ahead and click on edit. And then down here is my code. It's showing me what happens uh, with that code. And I'm just going to copy that. But let's say you haven't, you don't have a widget to begin with. So how do you create one? Let me back up and we'll do that. I'm going to click on Create New and come down to Search. And then uh, by default, it's putting in Corgi. I don't want to search for the hashtag Corgi. I'll search for the hashtag Google EDU. I could put more than one term in there uh, to expand my query uh, and to reduce the number of tweets or finds uh, that I have. Then you have some other options that are here. We'll let you play with those on your own. Then I'm just going to go ahead and click on Create Widget. When I click on that, it's going to give me a preview here of what happens when I search for that query. And it's going to generate the embed code. And that's what we need for our Google site. So I'm just going to click in there. It'll select it all. And I'm going to do Control-C or Command-C if you're on a Mac. And then over here on my Google site page, I'm just going to uh, click on the embed icon over under the insert section on the right hand side. And not, not uh, embed by URL, but I want to do embed code. And here I'll paste the information in and click on next. It's going to generate or run the code and verify that it's working. And I'll click on Insert. So now that I have it inside my Google site, I can resize it as a, I would be able to do a text box or uh, an image. And let me come up and I'm going to click on the preview icon. That'll show us a preview of the page. And it's giving us a preview of um, Twitter searches of the hashtag Google EDU that was in my widget. Hope that helps, and uh, you too can add easily add uh, Twitter feed to your Google Sites page.